shoot a tank, dude. Oh my god! Oh shoot! I just got it! Yes! Into the house! Oh yes! Yes, I'm so pro right now. <laughs> There's like no possible way. Oh yes! Putting a woman now, trying to get out. Oh god, kill him! You're welcome. <laughs> I don't even know where he is. <laughs> I'm getting out of this way. You do it. I'll push you. <laughs> oh my god, it won't let me. They were like, maybe if I. Oh. Uh, maybe I straighten up one. Building. Oh, I don't have a grenade launcher. Yeah, shoot up this wall right here. This one. We're getting this thing out of here. Now, which wall? Oh, shit! Oh, <laughs> oh god, I, I totally went for it then. I switched seats and killed that guy. <laughs> okay, yeah, so here we go. Here we go. Yes! Yes! <laughs> <laughs> What's going on guys? My name is Rapid Instincts, and I'm playing Battlefield 3 as always, and in this gameplay I'm using the Usus 12. Um, <laughs> before you do a dislike on the video or comment like, what the heck are you doing using the freaking Usus, you noob? Before you do any of that, let me explain. The reason I'm using this is to show that it is overpowered, That, and I want to discuss how it is <laughs> overpowered. And uh... If my phone goes off there in this commentary, I'm sorry. It's Wake Rider and Roughsack uh, on Twitter. It's where me and Wake Rider are trash talking right now. But anyways, uh, in this one, I'm using the Usus with frag rounds, as every noob does. Uh, the Usus has been called many names. Uh, the USAS, of course, which stands for You Suck at Shooting. <laughs> uh, the Useless, because like w Wood Baron said, anyone that uses this gun is pretty much useless. So they have to use this gun in order to get kills. And it has been called overpowered, uh, overpowered more than any of them. And I'm gonna have to agree with the overpowered. I hate the cry that about saying a gun's overpowered, or that a weapon needs nerfing. But in my opinion, this gun is so overpowered with frag rounds, it's unstoppable. I mean, already, I in my opinion, automatic shotguns don't belong in video games. That's just my opinion. That guy's using the Usus 12 with frag rounds, and look how far away he was when he got me. Did you guys see that? That's like sniping. But watch, I come back, I get revived, and I come back and get him. Now, if you can't say that, that's that, oh my god. If you don't say that's overpowered, then something's wrong with you, because seriously, look at that. If you get them with one hit, you pretty much kill them. Those were exploding around him, that's how I was getting hit markers, but I hit him with it once, and it killed him. So it's freaking overpowered. Automatic shotguns are are do not belong in video games, especially with frag rounds. That is just ridiculous. So we use this. I use this for a whole night and got 98 kills with it uh, in that night, and it is so overpowered. So I mean, it's it's ruining Battlefield at this point because everybody's using it because everybody's like, oh, dude, it's so easy to get kills, and some people are like. Well, when you rank up, you're supposed to get guns to get so that way uh, it's easier to get or to kill people. Somebody commented that on uh, Wood Baron's video about it. Wood Baron says, "Yeah, that or like I can't remember what he said. I think he said, yeah, it's kind of true, but it's too easy when you have somebody doing it for you.'" And he put in a quotation or in uh, parentheses the uses 12 because really you don't have to do anything. You just gotta look at somebody and pull the trigger, and it's one one shot's gonna hit them. So I mean. It's easy mode. You're like if you use this gun, it really shows you have no skill at all. Which I means it is a video game. You guys are like it's a video game. You, it's, you're not supposed to have skill. You're supposed to have fun. Yeah, you're supposed to have fun, but everybody else wants to have fun without you freaking spamming them with a freaking automatic grenade launcher. I mean that's ridiculous. So in my opinion, or not in my opinion, uh, well yeah, in my opinion, what they need to do, or my opinion on what they need to do, to balance out the frag rounds and pretty much balance out the gun. Is well, I think they're already when the frag round or in a patch, uh, when you have frag rounds on, it's going to lower the uh, fire rate. But I still don't think that's going to help that much. It's just going to make the gun more accurate because people aren't going to be spamming the trigger, it's going to be going slower. So the recoil is going to drop back down by the time the next shot is a uh, shot. So it's going to make the gun easier to use. 
So what I think they need to do is the frag rounds, instead of having an infinite range, which they do, they need to take it down to about 30 to 40 meters, and after that, it blows up. It it randomizes on what range between 30 to 40 meters. Sometimes it'll go like 31 meters, and the other one will go 39 meters, and then 40 meters, and 35. It just randomizes like that, and then they blow up. Anything past that, it does not need to be able to do anything. That is ridiculous. You can't do anything at range with frag rounds at that range. So why should you? So why should frag rounds be done? All right. So why should frag rounds do anything? The only thing that should get somebody at further than that is the slug. That's realistic. I mean, the slug on regular shotguns, you can seriously like that guy I just killed right there would kill a guy. Everybody seen the slugs on Back Hunting too. They were a little unrealistic with the range, but that was the only thing that you could kill somebody at with range. In this game, you have two things you can kill somebody at range and. Only one that's used is the frag round because it explodes. Because you, you can shoot the ground next to somebody, which is what usually everybody does, is they just shoot the ground because they can't aim, and it will kill them. Like, that is ridiculous. Like, look at that guy. He didn't even stand a chance. That was That's ridiculous. So that's what I think that you need to do. I don't mean to, like, I guess rant, cry nerves and stuff like that, but that's something I think needs to be done. And the reason it's cut out in, in segments like this is because I didn't feel like doing the whole game. Watch this. You can't tell me that's not ridiculous. Look how far away that guy is. All I seen was just a freaking Dorito. All I seen was the marker where he where he's been, where he was marked. I didn't even see the guy. I just shot over there. That is ridiculous. So, I mean, that's whoever's brain fart that was at dice. <laughs> I they need to be like I don't know fired I guess because they are terrible at making video game or I guess coming up with stuff for video games. Because seriously, that's all this was was a brain fart. Hey, let's take the uses 12, go ahead and make it overpowered, and then put frag rounds on it, and make it 10 times more overpowered, and have the frag rounds have an infinite range, and just blow the everybody the crap up. Yeah, you're an idiot, dude. So, that's, that was, <laughs> that was so retarded. So, I mean, like, this gun is so cheap, I will not use it again. Uh, me and the 101st Militia, we vowed not to use it again. And if we do use it again, it's because we're, we're getting really angry at the other guys. Uh, so, but we pretty much vowed not to use this gun again. But I might use it one more time to get the uh, one service star because that's what I'm going to do on all the weapons is at least get the one service star for every single weapon. I think I already have like 50 something weapons to a, at least one service star. So I'll probably use it one more time just to get those two kills. So, anyways, I'm not going to use this gun ever again until or at, until after I get the <laughs> service star. So I mean. If you use this gun and you don't think it's overpowered, you don't belong playing Battlefield at least. You can play Call of Duty because, you know, it's Call of Duty, nobody cares. <laughs> so, battle, like, in Battlefield, this should not be going on. This is something that that uh, Infinity Ward would screw up their game with. An automatic grenade launcher, which is in Modern Warfare 3, an automatic grenade launcher. Uh, how I know I played my little brothers, I know, I'm ashamed. But that gun, or that game sucks, I have to say. That game sucks. That's the worst Call of Duty in my opinion. But anyways, that's off track. Um, anyways, see, Modern Warfare 3, or Call of Duty ruins everything. It, now I don't even know what I was talking about. Ruined my train of thought. So anyways, I guess back to the useless, or the useless. Um, like I was saying, it needs something needs to be done quick. I know the February patch is coming up, but that's going to... That's... I don't think they're going to... It's going to be in that patch. I hope it is. If it's not, then they're idiots because the way DICE is going about doing these patches is taking way too long. I, you know, I, I'm kind of disappointed in DICE for the way they're doing uh, the patches and keeping us informed and stuff. It's very disappointing. One post a week on Battlelog or, or one post every two weeks is not enough on telling us what you guys are doing. We have to go to other websites to figure out when you guys are sending out a patch. You guys won't even tell us yourselves. That's that's sorry. I'm, I'm very disappointed in DICE. And I don't know what they're thinking on that. You, you guys need to tell us yourselves, not have us go to another website or Google it. So, anyways, guys, that's my, I guess, little rant on the use system. It needs to be patched. Frag rounds need to have a certain range. But, anyways, guys, that's the end of that one. And I'll talk to you guys later.